guys really enjoy the Kickstarter Dome, and today we're going to talk about a couple of things. I've tried to do this video like 12 times, and then it hasn't worked out, so let's just go through these things. One, social media. Uh, I kind of want to be a social media guru thingy in the bob. Um, and I used to hate people on YouTube, and we're like, I want to be in social media, because it seems like it's a really obvious thing to do. Like, we all know you that you want to be on social media, because you're on YouTube. And people who want to be social media people usually are on YouTube. Um, but now I kind of understand the vibe, and I kind of want to do it myself. So, that might be a thing I'm doing. Who is this mouse? I got it. It's pink. It's got really nice buttons. It's got a really nice track wheel. It's got a really nice... Um, connector piece for the laptop is really good and fabulous and great. Three, respect slash fear. Um, it is really interesting to be, like, in that position where people respect you enough because they kind of fear you at the same time. Um, because people will leave me alone because they respect my ex enough to realize that, uh, bad things will happen if they, um, touch me inappropriately or in a way that I don't like. And, uh, it's really interesting because I do the same thing to people, and for me, with him, it's kind of macho bullshit sometimes, but it also makes me feel safe, and that's, and it makes me feel like I don't have to sleep with a knife under my pillow all the time, and that's kind of a thing that I'm glad I don't have to do all the time now. Uh, I don't know if I told you guys about that story, but I did end up, uh, sleeping with a knife under my pillow for a while. I don't know if I told you that before, and I don't know if I told you what caused that. Um, but that is very personal, and maybe eventually, if I haven't told you already, I will tell you, but, uh, if not, I'm not really ready to tell you guys. Just, it was bad. Um, the other thing I want to talk about is my Camp NaNoWriMo novel, which I'm calling The Healing Novel. Um, I'm not really going to talk about too much of the plot or the characters or, like, the simple theme of the book, uh, but the fact of the matter is it's happening, and I haven't written anything today, so that's something I need to do, but, uh, leave that in the comments for me, um, leave me encouragement and, like, ask me how I'm doing every day because that's a thing that I want to start doing. I'm going to do a little segment on all of these videos about my writing because it's just a thing that I'm doing, and I want to open up about it, and it's hard to open up about it, but it is something that I need to do because it is part of me. It is definitely a big part of me, and I want to talk to you guys about it uh, because it's really important to me to write about things that I care about, and I actually want to talk to people about these things that I'm writing that I care about. I'm not going to tell you too much about what it's about, but uh, let's... I've talked about the kind of central idea behind it before. It is a fictionalization of a real event. So, thank you guys so much for watching this video. What is your favorite thing on social media? And what, and leave me some good vibes about Camp NaNoWriMo. Um, thank you. Thank you so much.